Grade 1 winner Mastery was a standout at last year's weanling sales, with his first crop averaging over six times his stud fee. We visited breeder Arthur Hancock and spoke about the pedigree behind the Son of Candy ride, and we also spoke with Claiborne's Bernie Sams to learn about the trends he's seeing in Mastery's first yearlings. Mastery was a, you know, four for four. He won the Los Alamitos Futurity. He was impressive when he broke his maiden race. That's what got our attention that day. We bought into him after the Los Alamitos Futurity and, you know, had high hopes for him as a three-year-old and won the San Felipe very impressive and he's done, done well. Test and Mastery is strolling away with the San Felipe. Mastery, Baffert winning the race for the sixth time. I bought the mare from uh, Bill Young's Overbrook Dispersal. And as I recalled, I paid 20000 for her. She was barren at the time. But it's a really good family, and she was a big, strong, good-looking mare. My dad had a saying, a good bull is half your herd and a bad bull is all of it. So I wanted to breed her to a good bull, and Candy Ride's a good stallion. It was a good cross. It was a grand-looking foal, grand-looking yearling. And you know, I had my phone to call Everett Dobson. I'd gotten his number. I was gonna call him right after the sale and say, would you mind if I kept 10%? Because we all liked Mastery as a yearling. I was getting ready to push the button and I said, oh, he doesn't want to be bothered with me. If I'd have called him and, and I saw him later and he said, oh yeah, I'd love to have had you as a partner. So that shows you if you don't do something, what happened? He's been very well received. He's a good looking horse. I think people like the pedigree. They obviously like Candy Rat, who's been a very successful sire. I mean, he's been, been very popular with the breeders. I think we bred 139 mares to him the first year. A couple mares that were in there were the dam of Sharing and the dam of Monomoy Girl were in the first crop. So, and he got good support for horse stands for 25,000. Weanlings averaged 160. Yearlings have been very athletic. The ones that we have here are very well conformed. They're all good size, plenty of bone to them, correct, which I think everybody's been pleased with. Uh, I've gone off the farm and only looked at a few yearlings so far, but the ones that I've seen have been very nice. The mare has a foal, a colt that's a full brother to mastery. Everybody likes him a lot. He's always running around out there. And they're curious and um, who knows? These fields here, not me, but these fields have raised three Kentucky Derby winners and two others who were second and seven others who were in the Derby. So if I stay out of his way, maybe he'll develop into something.